What kind of car is this? Hey, this is the all new 2012 Chevy Sonic. Woo! Hey, I'm Keith Burns, sales consultant with Gus Weiler GM Center. And today I'm gonna to tell you about this awesome new car. This is the 2012 Chevrolet Sonic. Sonic is available in three trim levels, LS, LT, and LTZ. Plus it comes in two body style choices. Here we have the five door hatchback and it comes in a four door sedan, which is 14 inches longer. Ford, Festiva, and Honda Fit, they only offer a hatchback, so they can't compete with that. Right away up front on this car, you're gonna notice the two-tiered grille. It's a dual port design, really cool. Has some chrome accents around it. And then right in the center of that, you're gonna see Chevrolet's iconic bow tie. Also, something really cool going on up front here are these quad halogen reflector headlamps. Unlike nothing else on the market, they are actually motorcycle inspired headlamps and they're a three-dimensional design or they're exposed. So something a little different, gives it a sporty look. <clears throat> Plus they have standard daytime running lights. So oncoming passengers and passerbys are gonna be able to see you. Plus this one has the optional fog lamp and wheel package. Fog lamps have a nice chrome bezel, give it a good sporty appearance. Plus you're gonna get a lot better visibility at night out of those. <clears throat> you can see from the lines on the sloping of the hood, has some really nice aerodynamic lines with the rake windshield, uh, goes on up, uh, great aerodynamics, plus the wide stance, the vehicle really hugs the road. Looking under the hood here, you're gonna see that this is equipped with a 1.8 liter Ecotec four cylinder engine. This engine delivers 138 horsepower and 125 pound-feet of torque. It's matched up with a five-speed manual transmission, delivers 35 mile a gallon on the highway, which is outstanding, plus 26 in town. If you need a little more horse, or a little more torque, a little more power, you can opt for a 1.4 liter turbocharged. But guess what? You're actually going to increase your mileage too. You're going to get over 40 miles a gallon on the highway out of that engine. The turbo, you know, you may be afraid of that. Some people, you know, aren't really too interested in turbos because of the maintenance. Well, guess what? This turbo is really cool because the turbo is actually uh, integrated directly into the exhaust manifold, so it eliminates any turbo lag whatsoever so pretty cool there plus the turbo has a maintenance free timing chain unlike toyota which has a timing belt and they're going to recommend you change that out at about 90 or 100,000 miles so that's pretty cool in itself also both engines uh, come with gm's exclusive oil it's a dexos synthetic blend oil and it's matched up with the oil life monitor so you'll know exactly when you need to bring the car in for service there are three other transmission choices. You can opt for a five-speed automatic, six-speed manual, or six-speed automatic. All of those transmissions, too, also have a feature which is called hill hold. So in the event that you are on an incline or decline, uh, when you let your foot off the brake, the car will actually stay in place until you put your foot back on the gas. Coming around to the side here, you're going to see that Sonic's equipped with an aluminum wheel. And this one has the optional fog lamp and wheel package like I mentioned before. So it has the 16 inch aluminum painted wheel. But guess what? Every Sonic, no matter what trim level, LS has standard 15 inch aluminum wheels. LTZ, you can opt for a 17 inch aluminum wheel. Honda and Ford, they only have wheel covers on the base model. Along the side here, you're going to see some nice painted door handles. And LTZ is going to add a chrome strip. Up here, you got your painted mirror caps, and then I like this little body line here. Really gives it a sense of motion when it's sitting still, so just an overall nice clean appearance on the side of the car. Coming to the back door here, something that's kind of neat on the side too, this car actually almost looks coupe-like because of this door handle that's integrated up here behind the rear window. So pretty cool feature there. Stepping around the back of the car, you're going to notice right away we got our Fixed antenna on the top, gives it a nice sporty look. Plus this antenna does everything. It does AM, FM, XM, and OnStar, so we only need one antenna for all that. This spoiler here, pretty nifty. Guess what, it's standard equipment on this car. Plus it has an aerodynamic design to it, so it helps the fuel efficiency of the car. Gives it a nice sporty look too. Standard rear wiper. We've got a nice painted strip here, chrome on the LTZ. And then the tail lamps are unique to the five door. They have the three-dimensional design, and the four-door sedan is actually going to give you an optional tail lamp there. Looking inside the vehicle, you're going to see that we have a tremendous amount of cargo space. We have 19 cubic feet right now the way it is. That's more than Ford Festiva. And then if we lay the seats down like this, that will give us 
up to 30 cubic feet of space, so pretty cool. We got lots of cargo space for home stuff. And then you got this nice shade here, so if you want to conceal anything, keep anything um, cool, you can do that. And it goes out of the way real easily. You just knock that up, take these down, and it slides right down there. Nice feature there. Stepping around to the driver's side, you're going to notice Sonic has a nice aerodynamic uh, stance to it. Plus, it uh, comes standard with front disc brakes, rear drum brakes. Your rear drum are going to be a little less maintenance. You'll be able to get a little longer life out of those. Sonic has an unbelievable ride and handling. Once you're in this car and drive it, it's just, what, what a ride. And actually, it was tuned by the same guys that tuned the Corvette, so that's pretty cool. It's got an independent McPherson strut suspension. Gives it great handling in the corners. Plus, in the back, it's got a semi-independent torsion beam suspension, so if you hit those potholes, the car's going to stay stable. You're not going to feel the noise and vibration inside the car. Plus, with the noise and vibration, it's built on a body frame integral, so that just reduces that altogether, noise, vibration, and harshness. Sonic also comes with standard stability control, and that system's called Stabilitrack. So in the event that you would have to make an evasive maneuver on the highway or on the road, uh, it, it'll help correct oversteer and understeer for you. Just a great way to avoid a collision. Plus, Sonic has variable assist electric steering, standard. Electric steering's gonna give you be more fuel efficient, Plus, it's going to have a nice on-center feel for you, so just to give you that precise steering you're looking for. Stepping on inside Sonic, you're going to see that we have more passenger volume than Honda or Ford. And then we also have more rear legroom than the uh, Ford Festiva. Once you're inside, you've got a nice comfortable seating that's had many adjustments. Standard on the LT, we have power windows, power locks, we have keyless remote entry. Plus, we have optional remote start with the automatic transmission. Once you start this car up, one of the coolest features inside the vehicle is this instrument cluster, which is mo actually motorcycle inspired. Nobody else has this. Tachometer on the left, you got your digital readouts here in front of you. Plus, it's got a standard driver information center, which is really nice to have in a vehicle this size. You're going to know exactly what kind of mileage you're getting. Standard AM, FM, XM satellite receiver with a CD player, auxiliary input, and MP3 playback. Like I said, standard equipment, great feature. Plus, you can opt for the connectivity package, which is actually going to even enhance your uh, radio features. It's going to give you a USB port that's located right here in this top box. you got a nice little storage spot, so if you want to store your iPhone, any other device, you can do that. But once you hook into that, you're actually going to keep your hands off your device then. You're going to be able to play everything right through your stereo. Plus, you're going to have steering wheel radio controls here that you're able to adjust through, this, through your tracks and everything in your volume. Plus, with the connectivity, it's going to add Bluetooth control, which is just a phenomenal feature. It's going to keep your hands on the wheel, and you're not even going to have to worry about making calls from your cell phone. You can actually do everything voice activated right here from the steering wheel. Really cool feature. <coughs> Bluetooth streaming. Uh, capability also with the radio. Cruise control would be optional on this car. Standard single zone climate control on the car with air conditioning. And then we have a traction control feature too that's standard. One of the greatest things that uh, Chevrolet and GM have to offer is some of our safety features. And on this car we actually have 10 standard airbags, which is unbelievable. Honda only has six standard and Ford only has six standard. So just a great safety feature on the car. Plus, safety-wise, if you, in the event of collision, you have six months unlimited uh, driving directions through turn-by-turn uh, -turn navigation with the OnStar package. So if you are in an accident, in a collision, airbags deploy, you're going to feel safe and know that somebody's going to be there to help you. Plus, they're going to give you driving directions to wherever you want to go, and you're going to have some vehicle diagnostic information, which is really cool. They'll send that information to your email. Or you can get the Remote Link app right here on your phone and do a lot of that right directly from the palm of your hand. Even start the car, uh, check the tire status of your tire pressures. So just some great features that Chevrolet offers in this car. By the way, Chevrolet has the best coverage in America. We have a five-year, 100,000-mile powertrain warranty, which is better than Toyota, better than Honda, better than Ford. Five years, 100,000 miles, roadside assistance. Three-year, 36,000 miles on the basic coverage. Plus, Sonic is the only small car that's built right here in the United States of America. Support America, support GM, support Gus Weilers, come buy a Sonic.